Today we're going to learn how to build a boat and it all starts here. Real easy to find on the new Silver Run Forest map. Go to basically the middle on the very bottom. Boom, right here. Boat yard. There's also a really easy to follow guide on the Farming Simulator website. And you can see right here, there's two steps to building a boat. In the first step, we have a wooden beam, board, plank, metal, and floor tile. 33,000 liters of all of those combined. And then once that's done, the boat will move outside and it will use wood beam, fabric, and floor tile. 4,500 liters of those. That's going to build the mast and the sail. And then it will go away. You can also see down the bottom left hand corner it says repeatable. That's because you can build as many boats as you want versus the roller coaster which you can only build once. Make sure you got your icons menu turned on at the bottom right hand corner we can see boat yard. We require 9,000 liters of planks, 9,000 liters of long planks, 5,760 5, liters of wooden beam, 1,800 liters of metal, and 7,200 liters of floor tiles. Let's go get it. Now here you go. Here's everything that you guys need to build a boat we've got nine pallets of planks by the way every pallet is 1000 liters should make counting them a little bit easier 9000 liters of planks long we've got eight or uh, 6000 liters of wooden beams however we only need 5700 just get one more than you need you're good to go there we got 2000 liters of metal only need 1800 and we've got 8000 liters of floor tiles although we only need 7200 so we'll go and take these and we will just push them right here i'll go right in now that we've got all of that you could see everything in our storage and when we start to fast forward time things will start to happen if we can kind of go in here and take a look we should start seeing the boat being built which is really really cool it's kind of fun to just sit here and watch i mean look at this check that out how cool is that so we're just gonna go through here I don't know, kind of hang out, watch the boat being built, that type of thing. There we go. All right. So now after first stage, it is going to move outside. And this is where the second stage is going to start. As soon as it stops, there we go. Now it says that we need wood beam, floor tile, and fabric. We're going to need, uh, I don't know, one pallet of wooden beams. We're going to need one pallet of floor tiles and four things of fabric. Here you go. This is literally all that's needed for the last stage. Now the boat has everything it needs to be completed and all we got to do is sit and wait. So construction will slowly start to take place. You can see the mast on there. As we fast forward time, more pieces will start to appear. As you can see going up through and then lastly, we should see uh, some cloth being used. Oh, it's starting to snow. How's about that? Oh, more pieces actually. Check that out. All the little ones. There it goes. And lastly, at 2 p.m. Oh yes, 2 p.m. is when the boat shall go. It's 2 p.m. now. <laughs> Didn't go, did it? We're gonna have to wait until tomorrow. Yep. Now, the time 2 o'clock is important because that is the only time in the evenings or 1400 hours in game that the boats will go. You may still have another one being built, but you're going to have to wait until this one is uh, sent off, something like that. Um, I have been told that if you go under the water, you can actually see <laughs> some of this stuff being down here. And I do believe at one point they do disappear. I mean, it's a farming simulator game at the end of the day, so we're not going to worry too much. And then as time passes along, the boat will disappear off into the distance. And as you can see right there, we got 300,000 liters for building that boat. Super cool. 